Hello everyone. Today in this video, we will see how we can install NASAS in Kali Linux. So first of all, we need to download the file um, for NASAS. So open the browser and search for NASAS download. Go inside the link and um, we will select the latest version of NASAS. And for the platform, I will select uh, Debian, so Linux Debian, Linux Debian AMD 64. Select it and then click on download to download the file. Click on agree and it will download the file. So let's go to the uh, download folder. So right click and open terminal here. And we increase the font. So what do we need to do? Um, first of all, I will change it to root. So root SCU and the password for Kali and the DPK command which means um, that is manager for Debian dpkt minus i install and then um, the file name as you can see on the left this is um, file name that we just downloaded so once it's done press enter and it will download Nessus, um in this virtual machine okay so once it's done we can see that it's um, also giving us the information what we need to do after. So um, we need to start the service. Remember, always you have to start the NASA service before you um, use it. So I will copy this. I'll click on the select link and press enter. And this is starting the service. So the next, uh, following that, we need to um, open this link. Kali colon which is the default port for NASA service. So either you can copy it and paste it, or you can simply um to um, even simply press Control and click on this, and it will open it. So once it once it shows you this page, um going to advanced and to accept risk and continue click on continue and um, I will register for NASA's essentials which is free click on continue and um, you need to provide your um, name and then email because um, and this email has to be a valid email so you will get activation code for NASA's essential so I actually have the activation code right now with me so I will click on skip I will put the activation code here. So once you give the activation code, press continue and it will show you the activation code again and press continue. So you can now define the username and password for Nessus. Um, so after that, click on submit and then um, the installation for Nessus will start and this might roughly take um, 8 to 10 minutes sometimes um, in order to finish the installation so let's wait for it to download all the plugins So um, we still need to actually wait for all, all the plugins to be compiled. Um, you will see the status over here. So as long as these, um, um, these plugins are getting compiled to 100%, we have to wait for it to complete you know, I mean, before we start using the NASA services. So it's almost done. 
um, 97%. Let's wait for it to finish. All right, so the compiling of the plugins has been completed. So now our Nessus tool is ready for us to use. So um, let's refresh this page. It seems like still doing some compilation. So once the installation is complete, you will be able to click on this create a new scan or over here this new scan button so it can be seen that the compilation of the plugins are completed so now we will be able to click on this new scan button or we can um, create a new scan from here as well so if we click on that we will be able to see all the um, types of scan that we can perform using Nessus so this is how you will be able to um, install Nessus and perform different sort of vulnerabilities scanning. That's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed and um, you found it helpful. And please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you so much.